Only on 23, too young to drink, but old enough to get arrested. Today, South Father Island's court allowed cameras inside to film spring break arraignments. Local 23's Derek Garcia was the only reporter inside. He joins us from South Padre with the latest details. Derek? Yeah, hey, good evening. It was a first for the city of South Padre Island to allow media to go inside of the municipal courts because typically they are so crowded and they don't have a whole lot of space to let our cameras go in there. But today, they opened up the Doors and allow us to go inside and see spring breakers who got busted overnight. In a footage first, South Padre Island Spring Break Municipal Court is opening their doors to the Barefoot College students busted, breaking the law. Most of them are college students from out of the area and some are out of state. It's a great city. But a majority are facing alcohol related charges, others are facing driving while intoxicated offenses. You have a charge of driving while intoxicated. It's a, we're, we're Judge Edmund Saganowitz offers no favors. Okay, so for this morning, are you requesting appointment of a counsel or not? And many of the accused aren't 21 and can't legally drink. How old are you? I'm 19. They admit they're guilty You're and pay a fine, but the offense stays on their record. You sign this, that's the only thing you'll sign is saying that you want to plead guilty. Police Captain Juan Herrera has heard every excuse in his 24 years of policing spring breaks on South Padre Island. You know, not consuming if they're a minor, and if they are going to consume if they're 21 and older, to make sure that they're responsible when they do it. Last year, hundreds were brought to his jail, and hundreds more are expected to land in his court. That's the completion of the jail docket? Yes. All right, good luck to you. Now, these court arraignments are likely only going to get more crowded because South Padre Island will see more spring breakers come in starting tomorrow as the University of Texas and other schools across Texas are expected to make their way here to South Padre. But for now, reporting from South Padre, Derek Garcia, Local 23 News. Brenda, back to you. All right, Derek, thank you. Local 23 will continue to bring you exclusive content from South Padre Island over the next few weeks.